Hey everybody, how's everyone doing? No guts, no glory here. We are back from vacation, hence we're in the room. So you know what that means. It's a Dollar Tree haul time. I want to welcome all my new friends here. Thank you so very much for subscribing. We truly appreciate each and every one of you for your support. And we hope you enjoy what we like to put out. <laughs> Uh, anything new and exciting to catch you up on? One video prior to this one, you would have seen a preppers video, just an update real quick. Since we got back from vacation, we had to obviously go downstairs and put all of the grocery stuff that we had bought away. So that's one of the priority things that we did. We had to rotate and date and yada, yada, yada. What else? Um, a lot of you who want to know how my BFF is doing, he is doing fantastic, guys. He is absolutely wonderful. Um, they gave me all a little bag of all of the stones they had taken out of them. I'd show you guys, but, you know, it's a little TMI. It's, nobody wants to really see all that. It's kind of gross see all the little stones. But anyway, there were a lot of them. So he is feeling chipper and like a little youngster again most of you know he's going to be 13 next month so but anyway so we're glad that's done with and simon is doing great as usual mischievous and a pain in the ass as usual but he's doing his job well <laughs> anything else to catch you guys up on no, we had a fabulous time. We took you guys along with us. We tried to as much as possible because we miss you guys like that. So, um, you know, the only downfall about going on vacation, for at least for me, is I have to wear pants. <laughs> as most of you know who have been with me for, since forever, I hate wearing pants. Hence, I'm not wearing any right now. I just don't like them. They're too confining. When God created us, he didn't make us with clothes on. <laughs> and anyway, uh, what else is going on? That's about it. Um, real busy this week. Hubby's not here. He is helping the daughter uh, with some things. I have kind of spoken a little bit about some things that are going on in our life right now that not quite yet ready to talk about but that's what he is doing right now he's helping her out um so he's he's gone <laughs> so he's gone and i'm here and i've got a lot of hauling to do guys i am so happy i did all that hauling while we were on vacation because i came home to so many boxes and packages and a lot of blessing meals which i truly appreciate those who have sent us something we we love you guys so so very much and we truly appreciate it um so i've got a lot of videos to do but i'm gonna start you guys off grand with the dollar tree haul so let's go ahead and get started how you guys doing let me know down below i'd love to know you know i you guys get i get a one-sided sometimes conversation i have so many friends on here but yet only a select few choose to talk to me i wish you all guys would talk to me that would be awesome you know get a little communication going here anyway so let's go ahead and get started what i found i went to one dollar tree in branson the one that i usually go to <coughs> they didn't have shit Oh my God, the last two times I've been there, they have been so bare and all the carts are wheeled out like, you know, like, like they just got deliveries in. I got bad timing and they just so bare, the shelves were bare, like, and you know, like I said, the carts were wheeled out, like they're going to get ready. Signs out front saying hiring. Well, yeah, I guess so. You need some help. <laughs> it was absolutely horrible at the one that we go to usually. But on the way home, I said to the hubster, hubster, I don't have much for a Dollar Tree haul. Can we stop at another one on the way home? He said, sure, sweetkins, lemmikins, honey pie. Yeah, right. <laughs> whatever you want, whatever your heart shall desire. <laughs> I can dream, can I? <laughs> really, he said, what the fuck? Really? <laughs> so we stopped at another one. I got enough stuff to make a haul and I locked out at the at this other one I went to one that was near the commissary Fort Leonard Wood 
went to that one. That And let me tell you guys, if you're in that area, it is a beautiful Dollar Tree. I complimented the manager. I complimented the register lady there, the cashier. All of them clean, uh, well-stocked, organized. It was beautiful. And it wasn't brand new either. So a lot of you think, oh, yeah, well, they're freaking brand new. Yeah, give them, a, give them a few six months or whatever, and they'll be like the rest of them, piece of crap. No, they've been there for quite a while. They just take pride in their store, in their store, which is awesome. But anyway, here we go. So we're going to start off with crap. And in my order of Dollar Trees, guys, for who are new to me, I don't do them any specific order. That's not how we, we're not organized here. No, I, I, I no, uh-uh, uh-uh. <laughs> but we got this. Yeah, and most of it's gone because we did laundry while we were down there. So we wouldn't have to do it when we came home. So, yeah, so that's what's left of that crap. And then, yeah, and we bought some of these. You get 55 instead of 50. Yeah, where's it say it? There, it says it right there. 55 instead of 50. So, we already use them as well. Yeah, to dry our clothes, make them smell mm -mm, so, so good. Then... I found some more of the Soft Whisper. And you know, the Soft Whisper packaging has changed. They've got this, you know, clear one now, which is pretty. And um, I really do like it. It's comparable to, I believe, like something similar to like Dove or whatever. At least the white packaging was. But it smells oh so good. This is Macadamia Oil and Peony Essentials. And it's hydrating body wash, 33% more. So got that because I was running low while we were on vacation on body wash. All right, let's see what we got here. Here, Simon, you can have that bag. He's behind me, guys. All right, let's just go down to here. All right. Oh, let's see what we got in here, guys. We got these. I went over to the nails. You know me. I'm a nail whore. Sure I am. I collect a lot of things. And all I could find was really were these 3D bows. And they're little teeny tiny bows for you to glue as an, on an accent nail. Or So I thought those were really pretty. So I got those. The stickers, Christmas stickers. These are the only ones I liked. So I got them. Thought those were cute. And these. Very, very pretty. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, let's see. What else have we got in the goodie bag? I know you're screaming, what you got in the bag, bitch? Okay. I found the little night light. And of course, you guys know I had to get this color. Because I thought it was so stinking cute. So we shall see. You gotta put batteries in it, which I don't have any in right now. So we're gonna try that and see how that is. Got these for mother because she wears them religiously. She sure does. She swears by these. Now, she's always used the Breathe Right brand. But they're a little pricey, even with the coupon. She likes these, but she has, she has told me, this is her little review, not mine. She told me that they stick on her nose like cement, like they're cemented on. <laughs> she said it's so hard to pull them off because the glue is so good. So there you go. There's her review. When it says long lasting hold, they mean it. They mean what it should say is your skin will come off with it when you pull it off. <laughs> <laughs> but she likes them because they do stay on. They don't slip off during the night, yada, yada, yada. Six of them come in, so they're the nasal the nasal strips. So I got her two boxes. She'll be happy about that. All right, got these for my BFF because, yeah, he went through so much, he deserves some goodies. So I got him the Imes Wolf Delights. These are the chicken what flavor is that? It's the chicken something or other. It's the chicken and vegetable melody in gravy. So we got him one. We got him 
two. And we got him, yeah, I think we got another one. We got him three. So we got the BFF, three of the Imes Moist Soft Food for him. Because he's a good boy. He is. All right, that's the end of that one. Sure is. I got lucky and I found only two of the Lashi. Now, I don't think this one's new. I think this is from the second set. You know what I mean? The Well, the very first new set that came out. I don't know how to label that. First set, second set, whatever. Yeah, he brought up his toy. Can you see him in that toy? Let me see if I can get you to... He's directly behind me. Come on. Simon, where are you? He's got, he's got his toy in his mouth. <laughs> Sorry guys, can't see him. Anyway, so I don't know if that's from the first set or the second set, but anyway, I got another one of those, of the star. So got that one. Incoming, Simon. <laughs> Gotta get him trained like Nina. For those who are new to my channel and don't know, you can refer back to my other videos. Nina was no longer with us. She was my Dollar Tree Hall kitty. She always stayed behind me. We had an understanding. It was an awesome relationship. God rest her soul. Now I'm going to train Simon. <laughs> but this is a new one from the brand new one because I know I don't have that one. It's the little flower one. So I got lucky. They only had just the one or I would have gotten another one. So got one of those. Got that. All right. Moving on, moving on, moving on. Because I can hear you guys griping and a bitching in the background. Okay. Got this for the daughter. Put it on the wall for the kiddos around the Christmas tree. These are those wall decals that you can put on wall art. So I got that for her. All right. This bag is full of goodies. I got these gift tags because I thought they were cute. They're 3D gift tags. There are 18 in here. So there are nine on one side and nine on the other. But you can see that they are 3D. They pop up off the page and then there are nine more on this side. They're very, very pretty. I like the that one there, may be bright, or may your days be merry and bright. So I liked those. So I got those. Okay, a whole bunch of these. Well, first let's get this out of the way. Yeah, this is a little TMI, but being on vacation, I needed this. So yeah. Got myself some of that. Enough said. <laughs> Brings back nightmares of when I had the lower GI done. <laughs> the colonoscopy. Oh my god. Anyway. Got these. Seen them. The drop-ins. Anything by Scrubbing Bubbles is pretty good. I have used their products in the past. And I've absolutely loved them. So I got these. I got one and two there is only one blue disc inside it helps keep your toilet bowl stain free for up to four weeks repels tough hard water and lime scale stains so i don't know we'll see but two of them i got a bunch of these because at christmas time as you get older Maybe not for all, but for some, in my case, for me, I'm getting to an age where I hate running to the stores. I, I hate, believe it or not, as much as you guys see me haul and stuff, I mainly do it when I either go on vacation or I go out only on Saturday with mom. I do most of my shopping online because that's how much I hate crowds, people, yeah, the stores, yada, yada, yada. Really don't. So Christmas for me, I don't want to do a lot of the hustle and bustle and fight anybody to get anything. So I either shop online or I've gotten now to where I don't even want to wrap and deal with all that bullshit. I don't want bullshit. No, 
I've gotten to where I like giving gift cards. Easy peasy. Just give them one card. Let them go buy their own shit. Shit they might like. Because it might be shit that I buy that they don't like. So there you go. So with that said, giving gift cards, there are gift, I used to give them in gift envelopes. You know, those little, yeah, all those. But I thought it'd be neat to put them in these. This is pretty, little gift boxes to put either money in or a gift card. It's got a little 3D Santa on there. So I got that one. And a little 3D little penguins on that one. See, they pop off the box there. Penguin says Christmas. Got that one. I got two of that one. And I thought I'd put the gift card in there. Bada boom, bada bang. And that one that says Merry Christmas. I'm all about simplicity. I'm not a complex person. I'm really not. Okay. Ready for this stuff? Oh my God. Okay. All of this is old, 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 old for you guys. But I could never find them. And it took me to go to this other Branson Dollar Tree. <coughs> I mean, Missouri Dollar Tree, because it wasn't in Branson, to find them. I found this little light. I thought it was cute. So I got it. Let me show it to you guys. It lights up like that. I just thought it was cute. They had different color ones up here this one as you can see is a teal then they had a pink one and a green one and yeah but they all light up like that and you just push the little button again and it's off and it's a keychain so yeah got that okay here we go let's see if we got these in any kind of order here i found the little puffy little teeny tiny tiny puffy owl stickers there are 81 of them on here. So I got four. Yeah, got four of those because I'll never find these suckers again. All right, let's see how many of this one I bought. Oh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I found the little dentist one when you got to get your teeth pulled or an appointment or whatever. I'm going to probably give these to my daughter because the kids are young and she takes them all the time to the dentist and stuff. This will be good for her little planner or her little calendar to put their appointments on. So I got her two of that one of the little teeth. Never did find those. I got two of this one because that's the only reason. Just because. And they're the little pandas and the little puffy stickers. There are 80 on that one. Look at the little apple. Look at teeny tiny. So I got two of that one. Okay. Found. Let's see how many of these I can get done here. I found the little elephants. They had them all. Found the little elephants, the little puffy stickers. And they have 48 in those. I got two of those. All right. The ones that have the little kitty cats and little frog and a little pig and they got all different ones. A little fish. This one, there are 108. See them? They got the little bone. They're so stinking cute. There's a little frog there. So yeah, I'll never find those again. So I got four of them. All right, this one, which I know I'll never find again either. It's 73, and it's the one that's the little puffy stickers that are all the little candies. Isn't that pretty? All of those with the cupcake. So, yeah, I got four of them. So, there you go. So, I'll be stocked up for a while on that crap. Last bag. Okay. Mainly food. Where are we on time? It's going to go over. Hubby said, ooh, he was with me. And you know him and shopping for food, guys. Which you'll have a haul coming up from Price Chopper from out there in Branson. It's their grocery store. One of theirs. 20% bonus size. It's a linguine and parmesan. Cooks in five minutes. 
So yeah, he wanted that. So I got that. This says New Look Popcorners, crispy and crunchy popped corn. These are cheddar feel good. Feel good. Mm -mm -mm. So he got those. So those are his. I saw this and I got this for myself. The Jack Links now comes in. I've always hauled it in the Slim Jims, you know, and the Jack Links, the beef stick. But they now have the beef pepperoni stick in the Jack Links. So it's a pretty good size. Yeah, because you know, not as big as I'd like, but. <laughs> what can you say, girls? Got it. Uh, I don't like these at all. These are his. You know, he had to have some boiled penises. <laughs> so, yeah. Hip, hip, hooray for him and his boiled penises. All right. I got these because it took me down memory lane. I like these. Not many people do, but they are good. Give it a chance. If you like peanut butter, like real peanut butter, it's made with molasses and real peanut butter. So I had to get myself a bag of the Mary Janes. You know, because... Yeah, but, you know, Mary Jane has taken on a whole new name now. Yeah, poor little girl. No wonder she's eating candy so much. <laughs> she's been having a few too many Mary Janes, if a lot of you know what I'm referring to. <laughs> All right, I'm done. Roll me over. Stick a fork in me. All right, guys, got to get off here. Wind up, put this shit away, and move right on into the next haul. Because we're hauling our ass off today while the hupster's not here. So, all right, guys. Remember to always let go, let God. Love God's all glory. We love you guys. Bye.